Today we're having the fun fair election and have lots of different rides, have a political slant on them and those things like that and just make sure everyone has a good time but also remember to register to vote for the general election. We are the future and we need if we don't take it if they don't take our vote our voice for now um, we will be struggling in the future because we don't know how the economy is going to be happening. We're going to struggle to guide the youngest as well who are coming for the future after us. So I think it's very, very, very important. I'm a Labour voter usually, but I've been really taking a liking to a lot of Green Party policies and I think they're really starting to come on, especially since the debates have started. Um, but it depends if I'm going to have to use my vote tactically to keep out people that I don't really like. But Stoke on Trent, it's a bit of a Labour stronghold, so I think my, uh, my vote's going to go to Green. So I'm looking for key ones that help students out more than anything, because at the moment students are at a great disadvantage, you know, they're coming out of uni and not having any jobs to go for. So it's a bit of a, if the, if the parties can help improve um, job opportunities for the students, then that's just great for me. A lot of politicians will say that for students it's just tuition fees. All right, that's a contentious issue, but that is the, the smallest of our problems. We're an underrepresented group. Young people and students t typically are. We don't really vote in vast numbers, um, and that's something that we need to change because we do have a voice and we do need to use it. And um, Policies can be tailored towards young people. If, the, if more of us vote, if we have a, a bigger kind of base, then we can't be ignored. So that's why we need to make sure that we're voting.